What's up, Ram fam? Welcome back to Black Ram GX Gaming. We're here, we're live. We're playing Rainbow Six Siege again today, working our way uh, through the ranks, seeing how far we can get um, until something else comes up that maybe we switch to. Um, <clears throat> but so far, we're doing really good. So I just want to see how far it goes before either I get frustrated and quit or, uh, yeah, something else. Something else great comes up. Um, so we're going to be switching over to that in just a second here. Uh, we have a little bit of different setup today, so I'm going to be looking in different angles than normal. Uh, the setup's not complete, but once it is, I'll be posting a picture of it, showing you guys what the new setup looks like, and it is fantastic. Um, don't forget, if you're watching for the first time, even after the stream's over, uh, please do drop a follow, subscribe. It's huge. We have that right now. It's one of the best ways to support the stream and help us grow. Um, drop your likes, your shares your comments, your stars, do all those great things. And if you're over there on YouTube, thanks for watching. Um, subscribe if you're over there. Leave a comment, drop a like, do all the awesome things as well. Uh, I want to do a shout out to Ashley Miller for dropping a follow here over the weekend. Um, and William Dodge for the like and share. So, let's get down to it. Okay. Oh, I guess I'm already searching. Apparently, I didn't realize I clicked this. I've been searching for four minutes. I'm really glad I didn't find a game because I was not ready for that. Yeah. Um, I'm going to make a little couple adjustments here. Super OCD. Basically, I've mounted my monitors and got some new ones. And uh, it just looks great. So I'm like looking up here now, side to side. That's better because before I'm looking across this long range and had no dust space. <laughs> now I got dust space. And uh, it's all just right in front of me. Also, cheers. Game one. Let's go. This will be the first time actually gaming on these monitors on this setup too, so in case I'm terrible, just know that's why. Super excited to be back on gaming. I didn't get a chance to really play much anything uh, over the weekend like I was hoping to. I was hoping to at least get a Friday in or something. But it didn't work out. It didn't work out. I was trying to set up all this stuff and it was a doozy. My original plan for how I wanted to set up my stream didn't, uh, or my setup here didn't work out. A candy, what's going on? Thank you for the like, buddy. Cheers. So I had to try, try again a few times. How are you doing, Uncanny? Good to see you, buddy. Haven't seen you in a little bit. What's up? I haven't seen you uh, streaming or anything. You keep taking trips back to hell? I think that's what you said last time, wasn't it? I asked where you were. <laughs> oh, snap. Look at that. You got a badge I haven't seen before. Anniversary follower? Follow Black Ram GX to earn this badge. Type notify in the chat. To start following. Having a badge on Facebook. Oh, well. One year anniversary. So you've been following for a year? Oh, oh shit. That's awesome, dude. What a year it's been. How things have changed dramatically over that time. So, cheers to one here. You need to use your drone to locate a bomb. Okay, you've been playing ranked here? Your if so, how far did you get? Bomb. I, like, want to hit... Platinum. If I got to Platinum, I think I'd be satisfied and I'd quit. Drone has located 
I was really trying to go into that. Knock it out for a second. Done with Facebook. They flagged five of your videos and you couldn't speak to them. So I've been losing videos like crazy due to dumb reasons. So I went to Twitch uh, and play music with no issues. Oh. Interesting. I'll have to find you over there on Twitch then. Um, yeah, they did that to like everybody. Um, flagged pretty much every video I had for a week after they did an update. I disputed a couple of them. Some I didn't even try, but like nothing was held against me. Which was nice, so... I didn't throw up too much of a fuss since it wasn't too bad. Uh, and the ones I did dispute went away. So I, they had like their own music that you could select from. So I switched to that and I've had no issues since. I think they had a bot, kind of like YouTube, set up to uh, flag people. And it just auto flagged everybody. And I think they fixed it like a week or two later. Downed him? What? I had no idea that guy was there. Lucky, lucky. I, I don't know. I thought it was, the flags were BS in the start, but, you know, YouTube has flagged me and taken down my entire channel. I don't know if you were there for that. I think maybe you were, um, about a year ago, because I complained a lot. I got so mad. Um, but YouTube took down my whole channel about four times over the course of, like a Thursday to Monday. Disputed it, brought it back, disputed it, brought it back, disputed it, brought it back, and then it finally stopped. But I was getting so mad because um, there was nothing, no reason for it to be taken down. Flagged you for in game music, and that's a lot of my videos. Lost a good portion of videos on Fighter Z. Really? I know I got scared when I played uh, the Quarry um, right after that happened because the Quarry had a bunch of videos that when I put the YouTube video up, Hit me with copyrights right away. And then uh, about 10, 15 minutes after, they said that it was copyright released. So I don't know what that means. I don't know what they did. I didn't dispute it or anything. They just released the copyright, and it was all good. But that game had a bunch of music in it that wasn't copyrighted, but... They also had copyrighted music, but you could select streamer mode and it was supposed to take it off. Still got hit. I was like, this is bullshit. <laughs> so then eventually they must have talked to YouTube or something and they got fixed, but it was annoying. Sheesh, wow, well, yeah. No kidding. But uh, your goal is to hit diamond. Have you hit diamond before, Uncanny? Facebook, YouTube, and some blue stuff. They, uh, both of them use bots or an algorithm or something along those lines. That's horseshit. Oh, look at his health. Damn. Um, some kind of algorithm to detect stuff they block. And then they have real people that go back and look at it. And it's just a pain. Because the bots get it wrong. But to the same point, there's just so much content on Facebook and YouTube that there's no way you could effectively pay a big enough crew to monitor it all. And then also, they're making arbitrary decisions based on whatever the reviews are 
Is that an aimbot? The way it just kicked over. That was interesting. Never. Want to get to diamond or possibly higher, but my teammates are having trouble registering their email and phone numbers to play on PC. That's right. They can't just put in a new account or something. I don't. I don't know. It sounds like it wouldn't be that hard to recover, but I've never had to do it. I guess. I think. I can't remember what game it was. Oh, Apex. Trying to log into my Apex account. Um, on buddies' PlayStations, I got two or three friends who had PlayStations and when I had to go visit them, I tried to log into my PlayStation one and I lost that account so easily. But it was like some secondary email I made up to play on there. They have to make a new Steam account and buy the game again? Really? So they can't log in because they don't have the Ubisoft account, but they can't just put in a new Ubisoft account? Sounds whack. There's got to be like easy Googleable answers for that, right? Because it can't be just them that's having the issue. I don't know. I'm pretty much playing solo, and uh, it's definitely not easy. I get games where we completely own and destroy the other team, like this one so far. And then I get these games where nobody gets anything. I had one game, uh, it's like two weeks back, where we had one kill, collectively. One, zero, 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 zero. It was, I don't know what's the right word, embarrassing? This ass clown. <laughs> Can't be the old Ubisoft account. That sounds just like a pain. But they've been having troubles with that for like months now, right? Have they just given up? Oh, that did not look reinforced. One kill through the whole game, dude. It was the worst game I think I've ever been a part of in my life. Like, I couldn't do anything because I kept being in um, 4v1, 5v1 situations. Almost always 5v1 because they just didn't die. Um... Not like I was particularly uh, playing insane or anything, but like the whole team would be smashed so fast. Oh, that's bullshit. Two of them right there. Down to one friendly. I thought I was going to dip through and get that first guy. I think the trouble came back due to uh, so many smurf cuts, bans, and correct emails and phone numbers. Oh, sure. What disappoints me a lot on uh, PC with the teams I get into uh, is the fact that the people these days have horrible hearing skills and cheap headsets. That can happen. 
that can happen. I've got a pretty good headset here, but uh, these Arctics, they're great for some reasons and terrible for others, and initially it was so great it stayed connected all the time, but once in a while it like breaks through terribly, it's just crack, crack, crackle, and you can barely hear any sound, or sometimes it just turns off. And uh, it's super annoying. Like, 80% of the time, it's great. But, like, eventually, it's just going to start shitting out. So, I can say that there's... I've never had a better headset, wireless, if you want wireless, than the um, Astro A50s. The They're not the most price-efficient. But... Let's just say uh, the quality is untouchable. I never had connection issues with them, not once. Um, sound was always top tier. Loved them. Yeah, the Arctic I-10s, and that wasn't good enough. Had to buy a uh, Sony PlayStation Gold. Really? What did PlayStation Gold do differently for headset? Stupid, dumb, dumb. <laughs> Asteroid I-10. Oh, it's what you had. Not Arctic. Okay. I don't know if I've heard of the asteroids. Hear good things from Arctic stuff. So, um, generally good. What I really like about these ones. Oh, slightly off to the right. I'm not used to my monitor set up. I immediately looked all the way left to where my <laughs> monitor used to be. This is so nice. Um, other than this thing's connectivity sometimes, it's wonderful. Uh, the sound quality is generally super good. Um, the fact that I connect my phone to it, as well as the game, to say I want to listen to a football game while I'm streaming, and I don't want to get hit by NFL copyrights, boom, you guys can't hear it, it's great, same thing for music. Um, so it's it's got a lot of upsides, particularly for the streaming part. Um, the Astros didn't have the double Bluetooth, but quality is just untouchable that's why i have asteroid 40s in case i need to wire in to get game chat volume because you can't just grab it like you can on pc the sony gold gives better surround sound and they're comfortable sony gold like a type of headset for whatever reason i am i'm mixing up i guess i don't know i'm thinking of xbox gold like the ability to play online for some reason i was thinking of playstation that way but that's playstation plus Nice kill. Ah, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. I just need to see that little um, bit of pink or whatever they had on. I knew I was good. As long as they don't see me first. You know, when you're looking through those windows below, they have a pretty good vantage point. Who have you been playing? You've been sticking around as Frost? On defense? And if so, who you been playing on offense? What are you playing, like Buck? <laughs> I'll say, this chick, Thunderbird, insane though. Absolutely love Thunderbird. These things to just heal you, pick you up, whatever. 
Um, and they're just on a recharge. Undeniably one of the best um, defensive objects in the game. Okay, so I think I thought I could hear uh, drone tires. I got scanned. I don't know where he is though. Ah. Now oh, I see ya. Well, I got boxed in that corner. Um, just in time for his little hockey puck grenades to get me. It took um, Cap Can quite a while to get into that fight, it felt like, but came in clutch in the end. It looks like he just blasted his teammate to get that kill. It's not what the scoreboard said, but it sure looks like it. Cheers. Kenny, I don't know if this is happening to you a lot, but this is a big problem I'm finding in Siege. People disconnecting. They can come back pretty quick. A lot of times, they'll sneak back in before the round starts, but it's super annoying. Like, a lot of times, it's just them getting booted back to the menu, and they get straight in, but it's so costly. So they came in heavy from the back this last time. So I'm going to focus a little bit more on the back here. That's kind of a weak trap placement. But could have good payoff. Uh, good payoff. Because if they come through that door at all, that trap's basically done. But, Ram Fam, if they don't, they're Gucci. I knew he was coming, I just couldn't move. Because it was that ah, that guy. Also, he got my trap. That sucks. I had a trap for both of them. And apparently, both got found. Dang. But I was clipping them for a second there. Those back-to-back -back headshots, were they not sick? They were pretty sick.
I'm like trying to figure out who's to blame for us going into overtime or not. So it's pretty much down to Givenchy. Givenchy? On their team is the only person who actually has more kills than deaths. And then our team, we got these two guys, but in thy elements, really, the, uh, excuse me, the guy doing the most damage. I'm only one below here, but I got those assists. Oh, got the hiccups, bad. Bad, okay. I really wanted that bomb. Yeah, they got it. Um, little trick if you're trying to get MVP, you gotta race those bomb sites. The extra 50 points per bomb, so 100 points and get them both before everybody else. Every single round will get you MVP no matter how bad you're doing in kills. As long as your team wins, of course. You know, there's some important parts there. Lantern. operator standing. <sighs> not bad, not bad. Did we literally get that kill right at the end? Just by him stepping on one? Oh, that sucks. I was hoping it'd be a claymore. Weren't you guys? I'm actually thinking, Rook, this is like a, uh, I'm not going to get MVP, am I? I was just thinking mute would be a really good idea. Frost hasn't worked for me all game. Yeah, I really like playing trap operators and just trying over and over and over again to get them. Because there's some games where you'll get people multiple times and they don't learn their lessons. And then there's some games where people just cannot be got. Hi. What? Really? 
hit. Op four has located a bomb. Plan your defense is according to the ten seconds of insertion. With the G. Gnarly. Five seconds. Good gnarly. Op four has located a bomb. Get ready to engage. Love it. I keep looking over here after I'm done with the place though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that monitor isn't just not there anymore. I think it's pretty cool. Pretty nifty. Mm -hmm. Gnarly. Nice. Pretty good nice. Good night, yeah. Good nasty good orc. You think so? Mm -hmm. That's nice. <laughs> Kayla, thank you for that link. I just smoked that. And you're on it. Hey, we win! Hey! Everybody party! Cheers, thank you for that like. What? Just myself. I realize how that sounds now. <laughs> You're funny. Thank you. Sam, thank you for that like. Cheers. Who are you? That one? No, no. I'm the big guy to the left. Oh. So then she left. Yeah. He was the guy who was hard carrying the other team. We wanted him to leave. Oh. So you can attempt to win? We did win. Hey. Look at that. Platinum's right there. Not far off. We'll be there in no time. Honestly, between <clears throat> Rainbow Six and uh, Fall Guys, I'm gonna be at least like halfway through both battle passes by the end of these seasons. If not further. The progress we're making is insane. 55 days on this one. So still got about two months. Depending on how dedicated I am, I could consider making it. I still don't know that I would buy the pass. see what skin we got this time. Hmm. Maybe it's because I'm searching. I'll just try again later. It's kind of cool. I like them all, but I like the smoke one the most. What? That's kind of cool looking. I feel like the downside is, is that there's a massive flag and all these flowers above your head giving away your position to some degree. Otherwise I really like that one. That's kind of neat. Prices on these things are just insane, though. It's like they think everyone's made of money. Come on, Ubisoft. You know better than that. Cheers. I don't know if this game even still has the whales. I learned this term back on Apex. Uh, basically, a whale... I believe I'm saying this right, is a person who, whether they're rich or not, 
have the money for it or don't are just going to come in and drop every dollar to get basically everything, all content that they put out there. And at Apex, this was especially prevalent because they would have events where they would put out collections of skins. And you would get um, some kind of handheld melee weapon, purely aesthetic, doesn't help you at all. Um, if you got the whole collection event, so if you spend like two hundred fifty dollars on skins, Got a good feeling. It's gonna be an MVP game right here. Secure the area, keep the bombs protected. Wall secure. Securing the door. Deploying shield. Alright, that was a pretty good move. Dang, I downed that guy too. I would have had him if it wasn't for that meddling, uh, I don't know, ace? Whoever it was in the back, that got pretty much everybody. Probably ace. I couldn't even see him back there, but he was just sniping everyone. I'm trying to think who's going to be the most useful here. I've seen a lot of people using him lately. I don't know why. But 
Well, maybe I'll give him a shot. So we know they're all going to push in from right there, right? So we just got it just for that. They're probably going to be the exact same strat. Why wouldn't they? It worked pretty much Protect flawlessly. The bond. Curiosity. Did I hit both? No. Op four has located a bomb. Plan your defenses accordingly. That guy wants points. Op four located a bomb. Be ready for assault. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds. I thought there was a, a friendly in there. What? I walked right into that then, huh? Not gonna lie, that drone played the shit out of me. There was somebody who was hanging out in that room. I don't know who it was. Um, they let me down. Sadness. Pure sadness. Cheers. Sam, thank you for the shares. Cheers. Last operator standing. Christmas. You would have been better if you threw that C4. Probably got two. Shenanigans. Okay. I'm ashamed of how terribly that's gone. They have been old Joni boys. Um, someone's gonna play mute. try it again because they didn't get through the walls we didn't play the room we tried to play their way that they were pushing in and they just outsmarted us i'll say this i really really was thrown off by the, not being somebody there Levon, thank you very much for that like. Cheers. Appreciate you. Donka donk out of me. Op four found a bomb. You must defend it. Adding my oh, there goes my last stream first, man. Dropping legs. You can stop worrying about grenades now. ADS deployed and ready to go. Dropping legs.
My question is, did we make those holes? Was that our choice Friendly to open up that dangerous. long window for them? Because I was super cautious of it the whole time. I kept looking over there, kept looking over there, didn't see anyone coming, and then stopped looking. I can't even ping when it's not my drone. Or when I'm not in control. 15 seconds. Oh god, oh god, oh god. 10 seconds left. 5 seconds left. Up four. Alright, 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 alright. Close game. Good thing uh, this guy stepped up hard at the end. This whole boat screwed me and uh, saved us in the end. When you open up the room like that, it's super hard to defend the room, but it makes it way easier to roam around and defend it from the outside. So I guess, I don't know, I think it's a little more advanced my game plays. You, you can figure out all the long peaks through multiple rooms and can do it successfully without uh, getting yourself killed. Or completely exposing the main room it's pretty solid uh, I've seen the pros when they have like the major tournaments where they have out hand out like a hundred fifty thousand dollars the setups they do excuse me and it's completely insane but you need like a full five uh, of people that know exactly what to do to get those setups to work basement yep 10 seconds before insertion drone has located a bomb 5 seconds your drone has found a bomb you've located a bomb make your way to its location and defuse it Is he really droning right there? I'm gonna cover him, but it's a real bad strategy. I just have such a narrow view because that 
indestructible chair. Wow, he had a perfect little view of me. I don't know how he missed the first few times, though. But. Impressive, because I had no view of him. Seriously. to switch up the people I'm playing here. Look at that. Their whole team's doing pretty well. Even the guy at the bottom isn't even doing that bad. This will be an uphill fight, but I've done it before. This other team plays like their uh, five-man squad. It's actually communicating, working together. We need to locate a bomb. I think I heard one of our teammates peep at the very beginning. Silence. Really? I'm them, I'm sneaking around, but lack of time. <laughs> it was a bad move, it was a dumb move, but lack of time and uh, do something or we lose. Push me in there. Five seconds. Up 
four eliminated all friendlies. You never know. You go in, you pop a few rounds off, you catch a couple heads, and sometimes it's all it takes. It's a bold move, Cotton, but sometimes it bricks out. Best Buy swag. The guy was nine and one. That's impressive. Oh no. Got that gold three back. Hate to see that. Michael Payne, what's going on, buddy? Thank you for the like. Cheers. The top of the morning, too. Pew pew goes my machine gun gun. Oh. <laughs> pew pew goes my machine gun gun. I like that. Hey, it works today. That's a plus, right? I'll say, if uh, you have answered the trivia question tonight, which for those of you over on YouTube, the trivia question is, what was the first US president to appear on television? Was it Richard Nixon, John F. Kennedy, Woodrow Wilson, or Franklin Roosevelt? Let me just say, it is an even split, and are only 25% of you are correct. So. Turned out that's a harder question than I thought. I think I would have got it wrong though. So, congratulations to those of you who got it right so far. I won't say the answer yet. You gotta wait till the end of the stream. But, you guys are uh, not far off. They're all pretty close to each other. They're at least within the same. 50 years? 100 years? At least 100 years. Cheers. How you doing, Michael? How was your stream this morning? stature but sure oh, my back I lean I, <laughs> I leaned back in my chair suddenly my back felt not great old man stuff I guess I am swell that's good to hear Michael not swell because it's hot like your ankles are swelling up or something just doing swell oh god that's about the scariest sound you can hear as a live streamer. Did you guys hear that? The do 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 when uh when you unplug something while your computer's on. Oh, that's what it was. Why is that loose? It was my uh, external hard drive, which is like a whoo, but at the same time, uh, rather scary. I'm gonna try Osa since uh, I have not been doing well. You heard it, aka terrifying. Could be your microphone, could be your camera, could be your sound, could be uh, uh, any number of things. All of which are connected at all times. The only thing that didn't really matter in this time and moment was that hard drive. So. Whew. It's never happened, but doesn't stop your chest from beating. We need to locate a bomb. The stream was shit tactic. Shit tactic. Maybe you need to rethink your tactics. Drone has found a bomb. Ten seconds before insertion. Five seconds. So does that mean like shitastic, like it was really good, or like instead of like fantastic shitastic, or like it was just so shit? It was a shit tactic. 
Someone get shot over there? What the what? You come again. Yuppers! Woo! Love that. Love that. That's going in the clip catalog. Your PS4 wouldn't stream sound. Then you got new wireless headphones. They won't play Streamlabs noise. So when I swapped back to my Switch, I couldn't hear it. So I got back to my wired headphones. Just not good at all. Oh. Um. It could be. Oh wait, I want. Oh. It could be. If you have the, let's see what it's called. Game capture HD. Oh no! Use a rip saw. Hmm. We need to locate a bomb. I don't know. On mine, depending on the audio, sometimes I have to switch it between HDMI and analog, and the analog is how I capture game chat. But that's what uh, the. Ooh. Drone has located a bomb. Um, it runs through like I don't know headphones or something. I don't know exactly how it works. Uh, but I have never had uh, Streamlabs play through my headset. Maybe if I was playing on PC, or it was plugged into my PC, but then I wouldn't be able to hear my Switch or my Xbox. So I don't know how you had that wired out before. That's interesting. Um, so I'm thinking it's got to be your, uh, audio source, so to speak. Oh, well played. That was close. I'm not trying to chat at the moment, but just get the noise from the game. What do you mean, not trying to chat? So, I mean, you could potentially play 
your uh, headset headset volume through instead of having an external mic, but you should just have an external mic that allows you to chat. Um, okay, that's super annoying. And the noise from the game should just come from the HDMI. Friendly, last operator standing. Because you should just have your HDMI cord plugged into your Razer Ripsaw and your Razer Ripsaw plugged into your screen. And then there should be a USB that goes from that to your computer. That should be it. And then it should just work. It should just capture the game, the volume, all that easy peasy lemon scoop. So have your headset hooked up to your Xbox, of course. There would be such a delay if I didn't. If I had it hooked up to my PC to capture it through Sound Labs, there would be like a 20 second, 30 second delay. And in games like this, that costs you your life. So, no way, no how would I have hooked up into the PC while I'm playing through console. If I was playing on PC, 100%, but. Because everyone else is going to hear everything live, but you're going to be hearing everything like 20 seconds behind. It may not be quite 20 seconds because you don't have the internet lag delay, I should say, but uh, you'll still be a couple seconds behind. Your headset gets plugged into your Ripsaw? It doesn't have to be. I guess you have to, to play on Switch, so you're right. On PlayStation? It absolutely doesn't have to. Unless you're using its mic for the street. But you have an external mic, don't you? Be advised your drone has located a bomb. You have like an actual mic that stands somewhere? Or are you using a headset? Insertion in ten seconds. I think I considered Five using my headset for all of like two days before I started streaming. Not quite that. You know what I mean? Um, I considered it before streaming, but got an actual mic right away. Crisper sound doesn't sound like crap. You might plug it in your computer. Then, uh, if that's the case, then for the PlayStation, you don't need it plugged into your ripsaw at all. That's the problem. Well, that's fine. You could use any mic, any USB mic or whatever, plugged into your computer. Um, I'm saying the Switch is funky, so you started in like maybe the worst console for figuring this stuff out. Um, the Switch, in order for a headset to come through uh, and you be able to listen to your game without just having like blaring, terrible sound coming from your screen or your uh, speakers into your headset. It's hard to control. It sounds terrible. The quality's bad. You have to use a uh, splitter or chat link cable. Um, and then have your sound settings a certain way. But for any other console, um, you just plug your headphones into your controller, wireless, Bluetooth, whatever. Um, and you don't need anything plugged into Here's your ripsaw at all. And in fact, that is probably the problem you're having. Using shield. Ready for so how do you hear your stars then? Uh, I just have the stars play through my external mic. 
Our external speakers. Ten seconds remaining. So sometimes I don't hear it. Because also it doesn't consistently play a sound. I usually just notice. Because um, I have the chat right in my face. Which is a big help. I need likes, shares, all that just fine, and it's not too chaotic of a noise. Um, like, the constant sound of a game would be. So, it doesn't echo back to you guys, which is nice. Ooh, I was coming for those ankles. Almost got him. Just gotta look out. Getting a bunch of signal disruptors points for this. Okay, he snuck up. I just heard that last second running. I was like, how did he get there so fast? Thought he fell from the top. All right, well, I'm out. I'll be RB. Just one second. Him. How are we doing here? 1v1? No! We failed to disable the diffuser. I knew that was about to be bad. I saw him aiming way to the right. And yeah. Because that guy didn't give me a second. I turned around on him. Pew pew. There goes my head. Cheers, everybody. It's going to be a big round for me and Pigeon Strips. Just right here. This guy's going to get two kills, I'm going to get three. And if I'm wrong, well, I'm never wrong. Except for all the times that I was wrong.
bomb location secure. Are you guys ready for this? Protect me, I am da bomb. <laughs> oh, I like that one. Thank you, Michael. Cheers. Appreciate the 50 stars. <laughs> Michael, I will protect you to the end of days. Let's go. Are you A or B? Don't worry, Michael, I got you. Well, and anyone gets you. But I might have to go over here to do it. I gotta get these ankles. Oh, Jiminy Christmas. <laughs> oh. Appreciate that, buddy. Let's get this dub. They're taking their time. They're up to something out there. That's for sure. I am, to be honest, not sure what just opened up. Me brothers, no one was even looking. Three people in that room, nobody has any idea. I just got shot. One on four remaining. Way to go. Pigeon strips! I said from the start, pigeon strips was about to have a big game. Um, I just underperformed. The pigeon strips is my horse. If I was gonna put money on a horse, pigeon strips. That's my guy. No idea who he is, I just like his name. I think it's time to invest more in the Thunderbird Express here. It's okay. Oh, thank you, Mike. Cheers. Shush. It's okay. Shush. <laughs> How are you doing, buddy? Protect the bombs. Ooh, and the like, my guy. Hell yeah, cheeks. How are you doing, Mike? What's good? What's going on? I'm playing Outriders. Outriders. I, that sounds familiar. I don't think I've ever played it. 
What's that one about? The squiggly guy. Okay. They paid for it, but. Swapping mag. Got him. You got longer summer hours, Mike, or is that about the same? the greatest but I didn't really have to do a lot I didn't even get an opportunity at the end there that's all right with me a win is a win getting carried by the silver three in high tier gold games <laughs> who could have guessed no pain, no game. That's my friend right there. Thank you for the like. Cheers. Check him out. He streams as well, just extremely early if you're in North America. Probably pretty decent hours in Europe. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be what? Early afternoon in Europe? I did not get a lot of sleep last night. I feel like I never get a lot of sleep, and then I yawn a lot, and I don't like it. I don't want to yawn. I got five and a half hours, but made it through most of the day. I gotta be honest, though. Not a good look. It's definitely fighting real hard to not fall asleep in one of our meetings. I got was stuck in like endless meetings at work at the end of the day. Uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Let's not unplug any more cords. <laughs> the coolest skin by far. I mean, right up there, that Montang skin. That Montang skin is sick. Ugh. Sorry. It keeps happening. I don't think beer is exactly waking me up. I like those coffee liquors. Ah, this is why I voted Coastline. I didn't want to play it again. Really wanted to play Clubhouse. But you get what you get. Hundred percent clash. Get her out of here.
That's a fair pick. I do like Frost. I find it funny that I got awesome Switch controller made by NYXI, swapping back to my PS4 controller, and it feels so small. That's fun. That's interesting. It feels small. You know, those Switch controllers are basically copies of Xbox controllers, so it's like... I feel almost no difference. The only difference is if I'm playing Switch and Xbox and, no pun intended, switching back and forth, uh, I sometimes my hands just go dumb and press the wrong buttons. Because they both have uh, the exact same thing, ABXY. And they just have them in reverse, and it's so annoying. What can you do? No. Using shield. Laying out the welcome mat. Setting the welcome mat. My beautiful evil eye is ready. Laying out the welcome mat. Of course. I can't even see that dude. That kind of fucking hurt. I was really hoping that teammate would come behind him, but, well, he did, but faster, you know what I mean. In my trap! Let's go, baby! What kind of head cam is that? I knew I put down good traps, though. Find it funny that every controller or console has an X button. I don't know about the other consoles, but the... PlayStation buttons, circle, square, triangle, X. I can't remember what they indicated, but they all had, like, a purpose. Like, square was meant to be your map uh, on certain games. Like, whatever games they had in mind when they were inventing the controller, uh, each of them were invented for a specific purpose. And if you remember playing some of those old games, the buttons didn't necessarily make sense like they do today. Like, A today is always jump, um, climb, whatever. Uh, X is, like, always, like, you're low. B is your crouch, get down. Y is switching between stuff. Like, that's just common amongst all games today. But, uh, you know, original consoles, the buttons didn't make sense the way they do now. They didn't gel as well. I can't remember what it was. PlayStation definitely had... A reason behind all of their uh, buttons. Using and I don't think they're particularly good reasons either. They're just reasons. Don't worry, guys. I'll reinforce everything else. No problem. Cheers. Work doesn't feel like work when you can have a sip of beer.
That would be a good opportunity for him to run out there. Op four, last operator standing. Was that there the whole time, though? I definitely didn't see any red lasers. Is there an invisible claymore glitch this season or? The guy that made squid games like PlayStation. Uh and that's why he went with the circle, triangle, and square because all the consoles have X. He didn't make a X Max. Interesting. I did not know that. I mean, I recognized Friendly's what it was. Hostiles eliminated. I guess I didn't think about that with the X. It's interesting. Do you see, I think they're making like a, first of all, I think they're doing Squid Game season two on Netflix, but they're also making like a TV show like a legitimate competition, like Mr. Beast, if you didn't see, made a uh, legit Squid Games um, recreation. And I don't know if he sold it to this TV show, recouped a bunch of money on something he was never gonna use again, but I heard that they have a legit TV show that they're doing now. Op 4 has located the bomb. Plan your defenses accordingly. A bomb location has been compromised. I don't think it'd be down. I just think it's like super late. I didn't trust that I had that perfectly right on. Five seconds and counting. Has located a bomb. Get ready to engage. Could happen in real life, it could only be made once. Mr. Big is getting locked up now? Getting locked up? Oh. Like he did the real, real thing? Wouldn't that be layers? Just kidding. I don't know. <laughs> People are watching. I'm pretty sure I've been saying that since like the beginning of Battle Royale movies and TV shows and games and stuff. It's like if they had something like that in real life, people would watch it. Doesn't have to be they actually die, but I think even if they did, people would watch it.
fuck did I get shot from? One four remaining. Op four eliminated. Mission successful. Why not? Oh, really? You didn't like the ending? I like the twist. I thought it was a good ending, yet a little weird. Oh, I can MVP this. Need an MVP person. That's right. Only MVP characters. Um, I don't know. I thought it was pretty good. I thought the main character's haircut at the end was weird. That's about it. I didn't think it looked good on him. I guess maybe it's not weird. It might have looked good on somebody else. It didn't look good on him. It didn't fit him after watching him with uh, the haircut he had the whole other time. It didn't fit. It felt weird. Interesting. Well, good guesses, good guesses. Hey, it's a good concept when you think about it all together. It's um, compelling, if nothing else. I can't believe you lined that up like that. That's shysty. I don't know about that one. All I could see was my ankles. Maybe. Incoming. Adrenaline boost. One of those people who loses three rounds straight, then turns on their aimbot and goes insane. It happens. It happens. You watch these guys go 0 and 3 and end 12 and 3. 15 and 3. Whatever it is. Completely clears house. They made movies like that as well for fighting tournaments? Like what movies? It was a lot of like Battle Royale-esque movies. The first one ever. It's literally called Battle Royale. I can't remember if it was, I think it was Japanese. From like the 80s or something. It's the game that literally PUBG was made off of. It really started the whole 
genre on another level. Like a lot of PUBG aspects of it come from that movie. Like the sickle and all kinds of stuff. It was really good. It was like a random school of 8th graders got sent to an island and they had to kill each other. It was like a traditional thing. And only one could escape. And uh, you got a random bag you got to pick. And that bag could be any weapon. Like one kid had an Uzi, one had a sword. Some get like water. And it's, I guess, just about surviving. You could just hide out potentially, but they just murder each other. It's pretty good. Obviously, Hunger Games. There was the Stone Cold Steve Austin one back in like 2009 or something. What was it Condemned? Um, if you're thinking of a fighting movie, fighting tournaments, all I can think of is there being Mortal Kombat's, which are legit fighting tournaments. <laughs> I know it's terrible, but I really enjoyed the original Mortal Kombat. Second one, I didn't see. And then the new one, I liked a lot, but I haven't seen it since. Drone has located a bomb. I like the new Mortal Kombat a lot, I just didn't like the new character they made. I kind of hate it. Proceed to bomb location and defuse you know, I saw potential for him to be in like new games and all that coming out and that I could actually play back to the games. But I hate it when movies try to be independent from the source material. So much so that uh, My air job is they're making it about a new character. Know. Stop being about the source material and starts being about their character. Wow. Arena. Okay. I was like, I've never heard of Arena. But who am I to say it's not a movie? Uh, Arena. I don't know if you've heard of that one. Dang, couldn't snatch that MVP. Wasn't far behind. I was playing the game too much. This guy was playing kills. Well played. Fragile Taco. Well played. I'm angry. Oh, he's a platinum. Well, that explains part of it. Diablo, like a Diablo of the Sea. Um, so what is Arena like, Michael? Is that like a Mortal Kombat? When I hear fighting tournament, that's the only thing in my head. I can't get past it. It's a B-class movie with Samuel L. Jackson. You take that back right now. 
There's no B-class movies with Samuel Jackson. Bank? Really? I mean, we gotta get rid of Kano. I don't think I could do Kano one more time. Okay. And by that, I mean, I guess we haven't played it once today. Of the three, they were all three good options. But, uh, Cafe Dostoyevsky is obviously the pick here. They haven't played it yet. Have you seen um, the Street Fighter movie, Michael? I've only seen part of it. That's like from the 90s, early 90s. And I could not force myself to sit through it. It's not good. People get stolen off the streets. They know how to fight. And they have to fight to the death. And if they don't kill them, then a undertaker walks in and chops their head off. Yeah, it's a similar concept. The difference is uh, a little head slice thing. You seen all of them? I, is there more than one? I thought there was only one. To be honest with you, uh, I'm going to guess the first one. That pretty much answers the question, though. Seen them all. Love them. If you watch some of these really bad movies when you're a kid, <laughs> then uh, you can still like them somehow. Like, somehow, like I was saying, Mortal Kombat. Don't know how. It's got to be a super low-rated movie, but it's just kind of nostalgic. Because I watched it pretty young. Probably like six or seven when I did. The Van Damme one? Yeah. That's probably what I'm talking about. Okay, you caught me. You caught me. It was going to be a good play. Found a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. Well, that's sad.
Gotta look at the ads. I heard Rook. He must have been around that corner from where I was looking. So I thought he was maybe down the stairs about to pull up on me. I got real scared of getting pinched. So I started looking down and didn't prioritize my reload. Oh, that caught me in a bad spot. There's technically four, four Street Fighters, the third is a two-part movie. Okay. Are they all, like, connected, or are they all, like, their own thing? Are they all standalone, or are they all part of a greater storyline with the same actors coming back every time? Which one's your favorite? Mine's the Don Hugo. All good. Vehicles. <clears throat> Ten seconds. Five seconds before insertion. Reverse friendly fire turned on for one of them. That is you found a bomb. Interesting. And it. Somebody's not sitting too hot on health. bullets he's put into this guy for nothing is getting borderline hilarious tell that Valkyrie's still alive I think she just went around There's a side window says there's a lot of anime Street Fighter movies as well. When you put the subtitles on or uh, on they don't match up. Okay. So someone will say Ryo you're a little bitch sometimes. Uh, and the subtitles will say hey you let's fight. That's funny. I'm sure they tried their hardest. Sounds like the like, well, excuse me, the subtitle people didn't uh, <clears throat> didn't really know what it said. They just watched and they're like, all right, based on what's happening, here's what I think is what they're saying. Hey, at least they gave it their best, you know. Jeez. Yeah. 
He knew he was in there somewhere. That man put up a fight. He got four of them himself. We had one kill. The last first round. Alright, we need to give this man some support. I'm going to be conscious of the fact that they're uh, smart about using their C4 because that's the second time they tried, first time they succeeded. Don't like it. They shot me anyway. That's awesome. I was like, oh, Jesus. Hey, Heather, what's going on? How you been doing? It has been a while. Five seconds before insertion. Good to see you back. What's new? Your mission is to locate and defuse a bomb. Restart your Arceus game. Nice. How are you going to do it differently this time? Or are you just kind of starting from uh, scratch and seeing how it goes? That's horse shit. Sorry. <laughs> it kinda is. Start from scratch, nice. Who'd you pick for a starter this time? I can't believe my teammates just let that happen. There's a hand right there. It's Jason Bourne now. Dang. He played me good. Yeah, I've, uh... I thought I might give that a year or so, so I don't remember everything too well, and I'm probably gonna replay that one. I don't know how many of, like, the new ones I've felt like replaying that much. Like, uh... Sword and Shield I had an inkling for a while. I didn't get too far. Um, let's go Eevee and Pikachu. I restarted once, but didn't get too far. That one's just because I didn't really like the catching mechanic. Um, or that, like, there's battles, but really not a lot. Um, but I just loved Arceus's, like, style. How the game was. So that's what I definitely could see me redoing. I just wouldn't do everything like I did before. Wouldn't one hundred percent it. Not that it took a long time. I don't know. What did I play it for? Like a month? I guess it did take a while. Mostly, I'm just excited. Like uh, 
I know Michael is probably you are for um, located a bomb. Violet. Be ready for assault. Violet and ten seconds remaining. I know the color. Give me a second. All I can think of in my head is maroon, ruby. They're not right. Op four has located a bomb. Rose, violet, and Reload. don't help me. I've got this. Oh, I don't got this. Scarlet, that's it. Just open that. What? I know I'm loud as shit, but goes from placing that to headshotting me. Oh my god! I don't even think that's reportable. It's well done. Shit, 100% each man in each area, or at least as much as you can. If you do that, you'll be close to nine stars. Whew. I feel like I got to 10 really quick just getting the Pokeball and the Pokedex. I think, I feel like you're getting less once you go beyond that. I could be wrong. Or if you're not getting less, it takes longer to get those 25, 45, 50s. So like, don't look at the post chat. I already saw it. I don't know if I was going to get Scarlet. I knew that's what it was, but like it was just buried so far in here <laughs> that it was like uh, I, I was going to have to fumble with it for a while. Secure the area. Keep the bombs protected. Uh, I don't think I have the uh, mental fortitude the to do what you've done, Michael. Reinforcing wall. That's why you get a chance. Cheers. Ten seconds left. Five seconds left. That's a fail. Yeah, you know, he did. Ah! Why didn't mine explode? The cap can blow up behind me? Not cap can. 
fuse. Mission failed. All friendlies were eliminated. Damn, I am letting us down. It's been a rough day. That Morty skin is hilarious. It's mortifying. I've seen the Rick one too, Rick and Morty. They're both hilarious. However, it makes your head massive. I don't know if it expands your hitbox, but. It should. Alright, well this queues up. I wanna grab um another refreshment. Then I'll be right back. Luckily it takes a while to get in the game and it takes even longer for the game to actually start, so give me uh about a minute here and I'll be RB. Elsa, are you there? Would you like to build a snowman? Oh, that's funny. Hey, thank you, Michael. Appreciate you. Can you build a snowman? I don't know. I've actually never seen... To the amazement of almost everybody I know, I've never seen uh, um, Frozen. In the time I was not watching it, people were watching it 19 times. Mostly kids. You know what I mean? Kids watch the same movies over and over and over and over again, and they just don't care. Doesn't get old. <clears throat> don't know how. But when I was a kid, I definitely did the same thing. I remember... Th I was so <laughs> there was a... <laughs> Is it going to do the lyrics and stars? I'll let it go. No pun intended. Just slipped out. Let it go. Let it go. <laughs> I like robot voice. Um, it was Donkey Kong, like Donkey Kong Country. They had animated films when I was a kid. Uh, well, it wasn't even a film. It was like the TV show. It was like three episodes of the TV show or something. I think I played Legos in the living room one time for like a full... I think it was a summer day or something. I... I for the record, grew up in a farmhouse surrounded by corn fields, so like there was nowhere for me to go. I could have gone outside, but I was still stuck on that small farm plot. Which I mean, it's like half a city block of land to screw around in, but you still get bored. So I was out there playing Legos, and I <laughs> I played that movie over and over and over and over again, probably eight times throughout the day. Uh, VHS tape of the three episodes. Uh, much to the amazement of my mom and my sister that I was able to do it and not lose my mind.
Oh no, it was more than three episodes, but the VHS tapes uh, only had three episodes on them. And I didn't have the a cable network that could watch it, so I only ever had those three episodes that I watched on repeat. Same with like the original Pokemon show. Um, only about a little less than half of the series I ever watched as a kid. Uh, because that's what I had on VHS. I had probably like six or seven VHS tapes, which isn't quite half. But there was a certain percentage of episodes I know really well, and then ones that I enjoy watching because I never watched them as a kid. <sighs> Dude. I was ready for that. I'm pretty sure that bullet went right through my uh, teammate's wayside. Don't worry, all three of us, we can just stand here. Dude, I was so close. <sighs> he got that nice little put and pop. But I had the barrel, mouth level, just had to pull one trigger. Shit cakes. <laughs> I was doing decent. It's pulling some stuff up. Ah, yes, like the old Pokemon 3 episodes were on VHS. See, you know it. Uh, almost every, like... VHS TV show you wanted to get. Say you wanted to get uh, Friends or CSI or whatever was on TV back in those days. You could get them all in up to three episodes on a VHS tape. That was it. And you settled because it was awesome. <laughs> it's terrible now. You get the whole season uh, on a DVD like 15 years ago. On top of that, you can buy the whole series digitally and stream it. Or honestly, you can usually just pay like eight, ten bucks a month for a service and watch it in like two or three months, depending on how long it is. So compared to what we had when it was VHS tapes only to what we have now, it's insane. You remember the VHS collections for a season? If you wanted a whole season of a TV show, it filled up a fucking bookshelf. Your drone has found a bomb. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds to go. Move over, books. We got the whole first season of 24. You found a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. Which 24 was a, probably a good show. I don't know. I saw a bajillion commercials on it and Jack Bauer. I just never actually saw it. Shouldn't say that. I've seen it. I never paid attention to it while watching it. You had the whole first season of Pokemon? I noticed on, like, Netflix and stuff, and I've been so pissed off about it for a long time. I'm like, why isn't the first season complete? This is bullshit. Turns out it is complete, but... The ending of season one starts in season two.
selling it. Op four eliminated. Friendly mission successful. It's crazy. Can't stream all the Pokemon. I thought the same thing, and then somebody else explained to me that actually it's just in season two, and I've been bamboozled, bamboozled for years. I thought I couldn't finish it. And I'm Googling it. People are complaining about the same thing. No one's got an answer. I'm talking to my buddies about it. I'm like, ah, oh, it's, it's complete dog shit. And he's like, dude, it's just part of season two. It's just the beginning before they go to Orange Isles is them wrapping up the badges and uh, the uh, league. And I'm like, that is so stupid. That's the real thing? Yeah, that's how it worked. I'm like, what? Halfway through one season, they go to a different area, and that's a different season. A then they go back. Well, you're talking about the Orange Islands or whatever? I could be wrong, but I'm strongly positive, almost 99.99% .99 positive, that they actually finish it and then go to the Orange Isles. I might be wrong, but... Like, Brock goes, and then they replace him with this Tracy guy, and then Brock comes back wearing the exact same stuff. I don't think so. No, when I when I free watched it, how they have it set up on. First of all, you can watch it all for free on their website. You don't need Netflix or anything like that. Pokemon TV or whatever website has literally every episode from almost every season. And, uh... I'm out. Yeah, it's like the start of the Orange Isles season is them finishing... Kanto. seen up to the end of black and white holy shit I never made it through three Really walked in on me like that, huh? Friendly, last operator. Op four eliminated all friendlies. I don't know. Every time I try to go back and watch it, Michael, I can never get all the way through and finish it. It's just really long. The problem is, it's really long, and I've seen. Uh, the majority of it, well, I've seen it all, the original, I should say, first season, all the way through at least a couple of times, and certain episodes, the VHS ones I had a lot of times. So, it's, it's hard to go through. Orange is when they're going through Johto, and then halfway through, they find the Orange Islands, and people forget that Ash beats their league, then goes back to Johto. 
Really? I thought it was before Johto and after Kanto. I thought it was like the middle point. The You're saying it's in the middle of two? Honestly, the second season, the gold and silver season, whatever. I thought that one was really hard to watch. I just thought after the original Kanto series, it goes downhill. Some of the movies were interesting. Obviously, the first one's a classic. Brings grown men to tears. I really liked the new live action movie, Detective Pikachu. Thought that was bomb. And honestly, if they could do more of that, that would be great. I liked it because it had a little more adult humor and stuff into there. Um, just the realistic tones. Yeah, I mean, it's not like realistic, realistic, but you know what I mean. Like that CGI was insane. That was on his head. Was that not right on his head? What the? This is bull honky. He's shooting around me. I'm beaming his forehead. And somehow, I die at full health. Hmm. Do they have like a satisfaction questionnaire for this game? I'd like to fill it out. They need to have one like Madden. You ever play Madden? Madden at the end of every game, I, if you play online, asks, how satisfied were you the game? Very satisfied, it was okay, or it was terrible. 90% of the time, I just tell them it's terrible because usually it's kind of glitchy. Depends. If I'm fully wired in um, and not off Wi-Fi, usually works like a peach. Depends on the other person as well, but it's Wi-Fi at all. It, it works like hot garbage. You hated the remake of the Pokemon the first movie? I don't know if I ever saw it. I don't think I was willing to. Protect the bombs. I thought it looked weird. It was like that claymation style, right? Also, they got rid of the little clip before the movie started, so no more Pokemon Vacation. Oh, that was pretty good part. He takes on the guy with the Don fan and all that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They played the little music for you. I want to be the very best. I had no one it was. You know, that just, that part gets you jacked up for the move. Five seconds left. Op 4 has located a bomb. Get ready to engage. I heard this gunshot taken out the camera. I thought it's down the hall the other way. Because it sounded more up than down. Where's the audio? Trying to enter, uh, do my inner uh, Dr. Disrespect as best I can. Oh, he 
got the shaft there. He put up a good fight though. You gotta, you gotta give the man credit on that one. All friendlies were eliminated. Mission failure. This is my best MVP effort of the night so far. Ends out in a 1-4 loss. <sighs> we'll get him next time. I feel like every time I play this, I kind of just go around in a circle from where I start. I start at the top of gold three, move up to gold two, climb, 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 bounce straight back down to gold three. This seems to happen a lot. This is the problem with playing solo. Solo ranked, it's dangerous. No, Don Fan was the star of Pokemon in the first movie. I mean, when Ash and friends drop their Pokemon off at a vacation area, then at the end of the clip, Charizard gets his head stuck in the pipe, and all Pokemon work together and become friends. I have no idea what that is. I was confused, because you said the first movie, and that's the first movie, and they're like vacationing at that point. So whatever you're talking about, I'm lost. Didn't mm, I thought maybe like some of the later movies had like a five minute intro little episode. Maybe is that what you mean? Was I don't remember there being one in the first. There definitely isn't on the version on Amazon that I have, but uh I thought like the Entei one or something had like some intro movie that had nothing to do with the actual movie. Which is like a cute fun little thing. Maybe not. I don't know. I'm legitimately lost. Are you trying to confuse me? I think. So you're succeeding. Callie with the band. You know what that means. Jackal's in the game, baby. Let's go, Jackal. Uh... Do an armory locker. She's pretty legit. Final drink of the night. <clears throat> Going to a little delectable treat called Loon Juice. L O O N. Tried it for the first time this last weekend. And it's amazing. It's like one of the top ciders in uh, parts of the Midwest. It's fantastic. The fact that it's been hidden from me my whole life, I'm not happy about. Be advised, a bomb location has been compromised. Ten seconds remaining. They had a little clip at the start. Even Pokemon 2000? I don't remember one at the beginning of 2000, but I had. That's like the only one I actually had on VHS. Never had the first. I had to go to like friends' houses to watch it. They put them on the VHS, but didn't put them in the DVDs. So maybe that's why I don't remember them. It's so long ago.
No, I think I know what you're talking about, Michael. Like, I can't, like, remember any of them, and it's probably because they don't exist in anything modern. If only in those VHS tapes, but... Nothing but fucking wall. Sorry, nothing but wall there. Op four, last operator standing. I feel like a loon, and I haven't even drank this. Op four eliminated. Mission successful. Oh, thanks, team. Put me in your backpack and drag me across the finish line. Well, that explains why I don't remember the uh, first movie one, since I never owned it. Like, the only thing I have flashes of is some, like, Force Zone and a bunch of Ladybug and, like, bug Pokemon flying around or whatever in the beginning. And there was a bunch of Pichus or something. I think that was 2000, maybe. Maybe that's what I remember, not the third Protect movie. The bomb. Be advised, Op 4 has found a bomb. These people shoot me through these little fucking cracks that you can't even see. Sorry. I'm losing it. I'm cracking. Obviously that. Ow, ow. Uh, he, he could. He could. Because he's down here. At hip level. And I'm just down there too, trying to save everybody. I'm happy because we keep winning. I'm mad because I keep dying from people I can't see. Susan, thank you for that like, cheers. Okay. Protect the bombs. So I am remembering uh, 2000. Okay. I remember things. 
Dan at the same time, back to back. What's going on, guys? Thank you for that like, Dan. I got a cheers for you in the pocket right here. Cheers. How are you doing, buddy? Ooh. That's got a good taste. I like that. Got a little kick. That man got drilled. Speaking of getting drilled, uh, <laughs> that did not work for me. Dogged your mom. Killed me. That hurts. Both emotionally and also emotionally. See if this team's reign of terror can continue. The bomb diffuser has been successfully deployed. Diffuser located. These two guys have been putting on a clinic. Oh my god, this twisted joke again. All friendlies have been neutralized. All we're doing is holding these guys back and they are killing it regardless. Particularly this Joker guy. He's insane. Literally has enough kills to account for one whole win by himself. Here's me with my one kill and three deaths. Second place. A. It's not about how you get there. It's about getting there. Ready for this? Need to use your drone to locate a bomb. Be advised your drone has located a bomb. No, oh, coming back in was a bad choice. I thought I could jump up on the device on the wall. Of my Lucy device. Ten seconds before insertion. Five seconds before insertion. You found a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. Recon X heals. Recon's already in. Wow, we won, guys. Glad I could contribute. This Twisted Joker dude's on another level right now. The amount of, like, um... What do you want to call it? Hip fire shots, I guess? Not hip fire. Uh, uh, shooting at the chest. People aiming way too low to not hit that head right away. And then them bouncing straight up into the head with 
pure, absolute, untarnished luck is astounding. But it happens a lot, seemingly. All right, I didn't know what I was doing, that, but that turned out to be a pretty sweet camera spot. If I had two or three more seconds even to finish that plant, I would have got second place at the end. Did you see their leg standing up? Get a lot of platinums in these games somehow. And back to that gold too, baby. You know what I notice is the MMR, the amount that you move up and down. This must be the same. I would have hoped they would have fixed it by now. But in the old days, you used to get like uh, 100, 120 points to move up or down uh, at the beginning. And then you get less and less and less and less and less the more you play throughout the season. So the more games you play, the more it just kind of settles in you in your spot. And then it makes it extremely difficult to move up or down. I mean, you're always going to get more points when you lose. So you're always going to fall further than you go up. But your climb will get harder and harder as the season goes on. Which honestly makes it less worth it to continue playing as the season goes along. It's always been a, a big thing for me when I start seeing the amount you gain per game. It doesn't matter. You could have 12 uh, kills, one death. And, and where you used to get 100 points or 50 points, uh, at the same level, you're now getting 20 points, 21 points, something like that. And it's like, uh, nothing seems to matter now. The climb just became an, an incredible grind, way worse than it was before. Fuck that. So I know I'm not playing my best. I don't know if um, it'll move up or down more based on actual kills and deaths. My points. Don't make me play border again. 
You know they're picking Favela too. Don't do it. God damn it. I don't really want to play Villa either. I honestly, Favela was the best choice there. Sad day. Finca? How have they been Finca fucked enough for that to be worth it? Tachanka? Who are these people making these unified votes? That's one of the only good picks this whole round. I mean, I, I rarely play any of those characters, but like, they're not gonna affect the game much. Yeah, I see, because this man wanted to play Jackal immediately. Ant502 is one of our voters here. That chose to take out Finca. Thank Chris. He almost walked right in that headshot. Lock and black. And he managed to block black ram. Interesting. Man. One friendly operator remaining. 
Somebody had to vote him out. Er, cheers. They're not gonna walk out. Just stand in the open, brother. It's a better play, but no one's coming for me down there. He's paranoid, he's panicking. He's got 20 seconds. The panic's what's gonna end this. You always have a chance to be a hero. Until you panic. All friendlies have been eliminated. He's trying to look left and right at the exact same time. What you need to do is press that guy on the left a little bit. Calmly line up a headshot. Take him to town. And then he'd have time to focus on the right guy while he was preoccupied with the claymore. Still can't believe that guy was two inches from walking into my headshot and managed to just snip me real quick. Lucky. Lucky duck. Cheers. Speaking of duck, this loom juice is incredible. found a bomb. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds before okay. insertion. Should have seen that coming. When you're in reverse, what can you do? You've located a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. <laughs> They're not cold. Good play. That's the first time that's happened to me with this shield. Kind of impressive, actually. You have located a bomb. Alright. Be right back 30 seconds while this plays out. VRB.
Perfect. Perfectly on time. Let's strap in, ladies and gentlemen. Time to bring this game back. I've had so many bottom uh, games. What are you doing? Which one are you taking? This one. Okay. Drone has located a bomb. What? What was that? I'm literally blown away. Five seconds before insertion. Welcome, I guess. You found a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. Two? What? No, just one. Welcome what? You're welcome? Oh, okay. I thought you said welcome like welcome home. We know this. Nope. <laughs> huh? You're a silly goober. That's true, I am. There's other people. Yeah, but that option sucks. Is there the one that you played? Awesome, thank you for the like, buddy. Cheers. Uh, What game could I have possibly played with blobby things? That wasn't this one? Uh, there was huh? a huh? version of this. It was like a extraction, extraction oh, Rainbow Six. Yeah. Yeah, I got there. Okay, I, that's what I thought you were talking about. It took me oh. a second to figure out blobby things. Friendly, last operator standing. Are dead? Oh, I've been dead for a while, but that assailant who killed me, assassinated me, if you will, just assassinated the another. Is now secured. What's up? And now a game of cat and mouse ensues. Uh, I see. The user is active. Looks good. That was a heart thumper right there. Jeez. Couldn't have been any closer. He had no health. He was one shot. All right, I'm going to start contributing right here. You can bet money on it. Although I wouldn't. Hi, what's up? Oh, my book on your 
She'd rather sit in my parts box. Yes. Cheers. Everyone needs a parts box. It's got all the random stuff you don't need. A parts box? Yeah. Can I help you give that back? Who is it? You were supposed to give me half of them. You have half of them. This is to pig. To pig? Tea pig? No. Which one? Which one do you want? You had two of those. Yeah. Which shiny one do you want? Oh, you get your All right. I accept your offer. Most gracious offer. Well earned. Oh, this can't go down, did it? Let's go. <laughs> Silly. Michael Payne asked how you was. How you was? How I was? How I was? How I am. How is you? Short, sweet, I guess to the point. What? You're powerful. I'm powerful? Um, strong, independent. No. No? <laughs> None of those things. Which rock rough do we like? What? Which rock rough? Oh, I see. Rock rough? Yeah. I like them all. This one. You're real distraction. Thank you. Op four, last op standing. Oh, I'm trying to win. Can I play? Friendly is victorious. Hostile. You can't see possibly can from I, that position. I can see a little. Let me play. I can see a little. <laughs> Let me play. Here we go. And let you play, but you gotta go on camera while I go to the bathroom. Them's the rules. Just turn on the guest cam for you. It's already yeah. plugged in. Where is yours? Oh. Where's mine? Yeah. I didn't see where it was. It seems to be everything around. It's pointed right at you. At me? Yeah. Yeah, okay. You know what You're on camera. Would I? <laughs> Maybe. They take my channel down. Protect the bombs. I recorded that video I showed you yesterday of them singing the song. They said that it didn't go against their channel. It's probably because they're not. What are you talking about? Reinforcing the wall! I'm singing on the live. Oh. I recorded it. Interesting. Camera ready to activate. Just wanted to see. Like it when you 
Op 4 located a bomb. Protect it. Drizzle, drizzle. Oh, I already have a drizzle. No. I thought he was special. Oh, wow. The exact one I start bomb, walking. He starts popping. That One turn and burn was so fast. I contributed, at least. That's a start. Mission failed. All friendlies were eliminated. The fake ones? Yeah, they are. Okay. All of them? It's the whole card, yeah. Okay, I know. I'm just saying. I think they're all the fake ones. Got bamboozled. They feel waxy. Waxy pad. Fake. And you can find a pack of Pokemonster cards for a dollar twenty-five. Probably fake. What about them? Protect the bomb. What are you gonna do them? I don't know. What are you doing with yours? Alright, so that's a good solution. I gave you all mine. What'd you say? Schmadown. Schfraulein. got me. Almost. Gotta channel the tiger. Nice 
fuzzy. I was waiting for that pop up. I was trying to stay on the move so he couldn't track me. Got me perfectly. Oh. He's just murking everybody, huh? Wow, that was close. We almost lost the whole game on that. Uh, I'm stepping up, I'm contributing getting better <laughs> as long as we got this ant-man anyway we should be fine this thing's fake as fuck what do I look like ooh Fake Articuno, fake Nido Queen. Volcarona, Raviary, Toxic Rope, Clink Lang. I don't feel the comfortable bomb. saying that one's name. They're everywhere. <laughs> oh, no, ant. Okay, and we won. Pulling it back, pulling it back. I'm even at least again. Not, not bad. Good way to end her out. Cheers. Completely out of contention from getting a MVP back, but 
That's okay. And shoot a laser. Not bad. He seems cool. I was considering trying one of those other guys that I haven't really tried before. But, uh, I think it might be a bad time. The last two, the camera piercing guy and the exploding drone guy, I haven't tried. A bomb. Or if I have, I don't remember trying them. Let's get this bread. This is the W right here. Scan. Oh! Oh, wow. That shield came in clutch. A double spike bomb. It's almost a genius. Whoa! I have some really bad. I'm gonna do that. Scared the shit out of me, I'm not gonna lie. He was silent as the night. At least somebody thwomped him. Oh, those usually do better than they go through the doorway. Don't worry. Nobody saw the thing. Great fix. Can you get some advice? Sure. If I have any to give, I would love to help out. What's up? Look at that. Ended out six and six, not negative. I was like one and four. Router back. Got to a respectable level. Uh, oh, no wonder Ant was so good. All right, he's already ranked significantly higher. You know, there wasn't any platinums in games before, but they've been in here a lot. You had a mate saying they they want they're saying they want their money back because you're not online. Would that make you look bad? Guess I'm processing the question here. If you had a friend saying that they want their money back because you're not online, would that make you look bad? I don't know. That sounds like an interesting situation. I guess I'd have to know a lot more before I could accurately give any kind of advice. I guess I don't fully understand the question or the situation to give good advice. 
I would say. But anyway, feel free to uh, uh, fill me in more and I'll be happy to help. But we're gonna wrap her up here. It was an awesome stream, it was tons of fun. Um, wasn't my best day on Siege here, um, but I still enjoyed it, I still had a good time. So let's look at it. The question tonight, actually had a lot of people answering this one uh, and it was a super even amount of uh, people no matter what the question was. Um, or what the answer was, I should say. Who was the first U.S. president to appear on television? Was it Richard Nixon, John F. Kennedy, Woodrow Wilson, or Franklin Roosevelt? I'll uh, circle back to the answer here. If you have not had a chance to put in your answer, go for it. Feel free to put it in the chat if you feel bold. Um, and we'll come back to the answer here in just a minute. So, let's do some shout-outs for all the amazing people who supported the channel in one way or another. Um, and just remember, you can support the channel at any time here on Facebook by subscribing, sending stars, follows, likes, shares, comments, all those things. A lot of different ways to do it. Um, whichever is your way, feel free. Um, thank you, Ashley Miller, for the follow over the weekend. William, thank you for the like and share. Uncanny, thank you for the like. You know, William Harris didn't show up today. Uh, he must have gone to sleep early. No Ryan Montgomery either. That's interesting. Send me pictures. All right. I'll check them out after the stream here. Uncanny Love, thanks for the like. Good to see you again, Uncanny. Hadn't seen you in a while. Awesome to have you back in here, buddy. Kayla, thank you for the like. Sam, thanks for the like and share. Levon, thank you for the like. Michael Payne, thank you for the like. And let me see here. And for the... That says 220. That can't be right. We'll count them as we go along. Like 200 stars? Oh, 175. Okay, it was right. Thank you for the 175 stars. Uh, thank you, Mike Loot, for the like and the 45 stars. Uh, no pain, no game. Thanks for the like. Susan, thank you for the like. Dan, thanks for the like. And Austin, thank you for the like. Appreciate you guys. Um, the answer for the question tonight was who was the you, uh, first U.S. president to appear on television? Was it Richard Nixon, John F. Kennedy, Woodrow Wilson, or Flank Franklin Roosevelt? I'm about to say Flanklin. Um... So, it pretty much came out even. 22% voted for Richard Nixon, Woodrow Wilson, and Franklin Roosevelt, while 33% voted for John F. Kennedy. So, John F. Kennedy is infamous for essentially being assassinated on camera. So, you might think him, but he was, what, he was like mid-70s. Um, Richard Nixon was shortly after him. Uh, Woodrow Wilson was a president in World War One, and we didn't have live television i don't think back then but anyway the actual answer drum roll please bing it was franklin roosevelt during world war ii or right before world war ii the only thing we have to figure out is fear itself that whole thing um that was him he was the first one so there you go there's your answer congratulations to the 22 percent who got that right i don't blame anyone for getting that wrong because to be honest i would have guessed woodrow wilson because he was the oldest president and i no, there's like, oh, it's, I don't think there actually is any like footage of World War One. Really, there's like pictures, but I don't think there's like any crappy movies. Or maybe there is. Maybe there's some like really bad stuff. But I don't think there was anything live at the time. So Franklin Roosevelt in the 30s when the U.S. entered uh, World War Two. So that's the answer. Uh, thanks everyone for popping in for supporting how you do. Um, appreciate each and every one of you. We'll be back on tomorrow. Probably do more of this unless um, I decide I want to switch to something else. I've been mulling over, going back and doing, um, oh, what's it called? Let me see here. Cyberpunk, now that it's like a way better game. I just haven't uh, actually taken the time to do it. And I think, I don't think anything new is coming out for a while. Oh, what's
what the fudge? My hard drive isn't showing, so I can't see all my games. I can only see 27. Um, let's see. Michael, I win, I win. Good job, buddy. Hey, you know some American history there. So we got Madden coming out on 818. So we'd have a little over a month. So actually, I don't know. I really wanted to keep playing with ranked in this, but I keep feeling like I'm going around in circles and siege. Um, starting in goal three, cutting through goal two, ending up back down in goal three, and uh, around and around we go. So, I don't know. Not having a team either kind of makes it boring a lot faster. So, I might try and run through Cyberpunk. We'll see kind of what I decide, how I feel, where I end up tomorrow. But uh, that seems to be the two options. So um, keep an eye out for your notifications. If you don't have them on, turn them on. Drop those follows. We'll be back here 6 to 9 Central, six to nine central time tomorrow. Um, don't forget to like, follow, subscribe, do all those great things. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good night and stay fresh, cheese bags.